This is the Canadair CL415, known around the world as the Super Scooper. It is the most technically advanced fixed-wing firefighting aircraft in the world. The Super Scooper is the first plane designed and built specifically as a firefighting bomber. First flown in 1967 as a CL215, powered by twin piston engines. In 1993, Canadair introduced the new CL415. This new state-of-the-art aircraft is powered by twin Pratt & Whitney PW123AF turboprop engine. These engines can each generate over 2300 shaft horsepower at takeoff, allowing for excellent short field performance. It has taken off in less than 600 feet and landed in a tortoise 400 feet. Flying with the grace of an eagle, yet built with the strength of a main battle tank, the CL415 is at home on improved, unimproved runways, and of course, it thrives on water. These tanks can be filled from land bases with water, FOSS check chemicals, or by skimming across lakes, rivers, or even the ocean. When the Super Scooper needs to refill its dry tanks, it drops in low over the water. Skimming the wave tops, the pilot hits a button and lowers the suction devices. There's one on both sides. In less than 12 seconds, he can replenish his dry tanks with over 1,600 gallons of water. The Super Scooper is two 150-liter foam injection tanks next to its main water tanks. It has two additional 150-liter foam injection tanks in its rear fuselage, giving it a total of 600 liters of foam injection to add to its water supply. The Super Scooper comes with an anchor, extra cargo space, and a cockpit hatch for easy access to the roof. The CL415 has a state-of-the-art, fully electronic flight instrumentation system, and the cockpit is fully air-conditioned to help reduce crew fatigue. Here the Canadair Super Scooper demonstrates its precision airstrike capabilities. It is able to make drops at speeds as slow as 85 knots. Sweeping in to fill its tanks, the planes need only a length of 4,000 feet of 6 foot deep water to make a scoop. Wind whip waters are no problem as these planes can easily slice through swells up to five feet high. In the spring of 1998, a super scooper was flown from Quebec to southern Mexico, where over for a month it helped battle the great fires of Mexico, making water pickups from altitudes at over 8,000 feet and drops from over 12,000 feet. The Super Scooper was credited with saving 37 firefighters surrounded by fire, whereby it swooped in, making seven drops opening a corridor in the fire that crews could escape through. The Super Scooper will serve well into the late 21st century. Here Yeah, digital camera. It's the state of the art for
Thank you. 